Hi guys, welcome back to Divinity Original Sin. So we've decided to put off the Black Pits fight until we we're gonna go explore like over here where there's some valuables. Ken is already on his way apparently. Actually, I saw some mushrooms. I need the mushrooms. You got the sound, Mike. I need mushrooms. Oh uh, no, we all need mushrooms. So we're gonna go basically look at the valuables, see if there's anything good in there. As I said hitting 13 would be good. Uh, we don't have the chicken with us anymore, so that should make things easier. Like but I've never seen one for myself. Aren't you an elf? Okay, whatever. I see you, but you are no elf. This place is not for you. Its trial is not for you to attempt. All right, we take our leave. Uh, I'm gonna talk to you. I'm gonna get to be able to talk to it. I see you. An elf by appearance is not always an elf by heart. Prove yourself. Overcome the trial. And stand as a true elf. We're ready to begin. A true elf knows that nature is a finer weapon than even the sharpest blade. The four seasons have served our people well. Four heroes rest before you. Wielders of the seasons. Pay homage to their skills. Solve their riddle. And prove yourself. If you can. Winter shudders with ice and snow. Autumn rumbles, the sky lit aglow. Summer burns, air fiery as a hearth. Spring quenches with bloody rebirth. Who or what are we speaking to? I am the voice of the fire. My flame bears the will of all elves and lights the way for those who wish to prove their mettle. All right. The totem is still and silent. Uh. The totem looms over you. Okay, well, there's nothing to do with that. So, let me just try, like... So, there's a riddle here. Powerful Awakening. Champion of the Gods. Yeah, window of opportunity. I'm just seeing we turn against the Magisters. I don't know why that thing's open. So what was the thing it asked me to do before? Uh, I'll have a, another look. I'm assuming you just used the element on them or something? The Maybe. Winter so... Shudders with ice and snow. Autumn, Autumn rumbles. rumbles. The sky lit aglow. Summer burns, air fiery as a hearth. Spring quenches. With bloody rebirth. Okay, spring bloody rebirth, so I I mean I could just put blood on it or something, make it bleed. So that's that seems like an easy test. Yeah. That's uh, active now. From within the totem, an otherworldly voice. Spring. Gentle so that the others may be strong. The fallen quench the soil with their blood and hasten the rebirth. Death becomes life, as is our way. Alright, I think summer was fire, but it might have been air, but I'll see. Okay, it's definitely not the solution. Alright, let me... Want air on it? I see you. Uh, yeah, air as fiery as hearth, as a hearth. Autumn rumbles. Autumn sky is sky a lit a glow. Summer burns, air fiery as a hearth. Spring quenches. So yeah, do you have something air to use on that? I have, I have like a shit ton of arrows, which by the way I still have all of them in my fucking hop bar. Every time I, think I, I remove. time because I don't think I have anything for that. Hmm. I mean, the thing is, if I'm wrong, I waste arrows. <laughs> so what I'm well, if I'm if all I ever do is like use a, a grenade, I guess. Mm. Yeah. So either way, I'm I'm gonna look at some of my skills here. Just hold up. Uh. What else do I have? What is wordprint? So, I, I I as like I said, I think it's air related. Okay, well, I guess fine. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try shocking arrow it then. 
I mean, let me just look at it one more time. So, summer, summer, air, summer burns air, air fiery as a hearth. That, it, that really seems like fire to me. Like, air fiery as a hearth. Because I used blood on that one and it was fine with it. Hot air. I mean, what else can you do? I'm gonna try using the burning one on the uh, on the Hero Winter actually. Let's see what let's see what happens there. Start a fight. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's the opposite. The totem is still. No, oh, that wasn't it. Okay. Maybe ex maybe explosion. Fuck. <laughs> Good try. Wait, what's the other one say? Winter Autumn, with ice. the sky alit a glow. I mean, that seems like something like light related, but we don't have any light related spells or arrows for that matter. As I said, I, I could only get that one. I, I I'm not sure about the rest of these. Is it is it internet time? It might be just so we don't waste shit. I hate wasting shit. Alright, let's have a look. A tongue of flame. Also, we don't, we don't have any elemental stuff at all, really. Yeah, that's uh, that's kind of well. We we have scrolls, but they've been less Again, common than using shit. Well, they're less common than we thought, because I haven't even gotten a whole lot of scrolls. All right. So, um, Autumn is creating an electrified steam cloud. I have I have arrows for that. Yeah, did it? Yeah, yeah, he's on. Yeah. An ancient, echoing voice rises from within the totem. Autumn, the turbulent beauty. It brings color to our home and death to our enemies. Oh, sorry, I didn't, the totem I didn't listen to it all. Ahead. Oh, fuck it, whatever. Alright. It went away, though. That's weird. Okay, uh, so the next one is, um, the Hero Summer Create a Fire Cloud. It says, create a fire cloud by converting a fire surface, fire arrow, searing daggers, or phoenix dive, into a cloud using arrow search spell va Vaporize. Or you can convert a steam cloud into a poison cloud with contamination and igniting the cloud. So we don't have any of those skills. I have a. I can make a poison cloud. Or let me try. Let me try igniting it. Yeah. I mean that's that's hard. What can I say? Do I have poison cloud? I don't actually have poison cloud. Yeah. Okay. So maybe I have a poison cloud grenade. Let me look. Right. I have a poison cloud grenade. Alright, try and try and throw it then. No, and then At I'll the go. The summer. Uh, yep. Right, go in it. What the fuck? Okay, it totally did not work. Yeah, we don't have a lot of skills for this. You can generate a, a fire cloud directly by using abilities: laser ray and fire slug. Do you have any of those? I have fire slug. Oh, do you? Oh, well. Do that then. Gonna put it on again because I took it off for a better ring. I didn't realize you had that. I would have wanted to be bothered. Alright, fire slug, what do you do? <coughs> Laser ray. Yeah. You did it. A deep voice rises from within the totem. Summer. Fierce and unyielding. May we cast the power of the sun against those who bring violence. The sun gives life to our trees, but burns their flesh. Alright, and this one's easy. This is just a fire freezing arrow. I'm pretty sure I had one. Yeah, just one. From somewhere within the totem, a voice booms. Winter, that armors our forest home in ice and snow. Let it make our enemies stumble and fall, and make them easy meals for our spears. 
I see you. The trial remains uh, incomplete. Do we really have to activate them all at once? Fuck. Okay, we may have to activate them all at once, which means I have to load. Yeah. Uh, well, which is problematic because the shit does not last forever. Um. Yeah. So we have to do it like in sync. So I can get this one. Wait, maybe maybe you don't. One sec. Uh, it was apparently a fight after this. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I'm reading this shit and it's like, uh, it's telling me what's gonna happen, so, I don't know. But we did do it all, but I, it's, I find it weird that they didn't, uh, complete the trial, defeat the challengers. Why did it go away? It makes no sense. Because the other one didn't go away. Uh, uh, because They're temporary. blood doesn't go away. Yeah. The blood's still there. I think it's because... The ice turned to water, the steam cloud got de-electrified, and the fire cloud went away. Yeah, okay. So it was electric cloud on the autumn one, and f freezing arrow on the on on the winter one. If you want, I can I can electric cloud that. You can freezing cloud. You can freeze the other one, and I'll fire the other one. So. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of how it's gonna have to work. I mean, we it looks like we have a bit of a time before. It all goes, but yeah, we'll see how this goes go down. Alright. Okay, let me get the uh, ring back on. Freezing air ready. On your Not signal. On, on your signal, unleash hell. Just give me a second. Yeah. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna see you do it. No, 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 do it. There you go. I see you. The fuck? That that no wait, the hero of autumn doesn't have the thing on him. What the fuck? By the thundercloud arrow. Uh not arrow. Oh a thunderbolt arrow. Fuck. We lost. It was a thunderbolt grenade. Fucking on the lost. Alright, we start the game. Uh, uh, <laughs> start the game, gonna fuck it's yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'll do my arrow. So I, then. I, I need a static cloud. Of I can probably do a freezing grenade if you want. I, to. I, I can. I can do both arrows. It's fine. There's enough okay, time. Okay, you can do both. I mean, it's, in either case, like when, when else we're gonna use them, right? Pretty much. There's no case where I've ever really. I mean, there's been like the one case on that big ass hilltop fight where I was firing fire arrows, but. I mean. I mean. They're in not, that same situation, I've like I could do that with molotovs as well. <laughs> they're not that great. Yeah. All right. I think right. fire's like one of the most common things. I'm not in the game yet. Uh, fucking lost. So what can I say? Uh, I didn't spec into loading screen. Er, er, er. Okay, go. Just... When you cast your thing, I'll... Uh... Okay, start casting your shit then. Done. Alright, we did it. Uh, speaking to me. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yes, uh, yes. You have solved the riddle <laughs> and shown mastery over the seasons. Now you must face the trial of combat. <laughs> Pretty sure I press end, it's gonna fuck us up. Yeah, so. Uh, so let me just. Uh, oh, high ground. Oh, there's some high ground here. Yeah, uh, high ground, you said? Don't mind if I do. <laughs> this is a beast down there. No, no, don't Hey, worry. look, there's blood down there, too. Right, um... Such a thoughtful engagement. I always want to be right next to Sibyl. It's like we're just asking for splash damage. Because I like high ground, alright? All right. Also, like, hey. Start it whenever you want. Go, do it. Okay. Starting it. What the fuck? Well then. Hey, look, they're immune to magic. No, not Sibyl. Why? I mean, she hey, could. How high level are these guys? 14! Alright, this is gonna be a tough fight. Yeah, that's why I knew that was gonna be the case. Okay, I'm gonna put the guy up here in prison. I'm gonna... I'm gonna go in this for a turn. I got speed. Oh, shit. Uh, hey, Red Prince is hey, dead. Hey, he's dead. 
Maybe we should do this now. Is, <laughs> why is it everything we try to do is too difficult? George's load to get it out of here. Yeah, fuck this shit, actually. Well, at least we kind of know what to do now, so it's all good. Fuck it, this is this game rapidly turned into nope, you can't do this yet. Thing is, I don't even know how much stronger we're gonna get in a couple levels. Cause it's like, what what do you even get? Like a, like a point of constitution? I'm just hoping like it's it's more about finding gear in this place than it is about, you know, doing these weird ass trials or whatever. But anyways, we'll we'll see. Because I mean, it is kind of like a a very non linear game in that sense. I mean, Divinity One wasn't really a linear game either. I think Divinity One scaled a little bit better than this. I mean, it was also the fact that this you feels could like CC it's like no, this fight is too tough for you. No, but you can CC the shit out of everything, though. Yeah. All right. Well, let's just uh, continue on our merry adventure here. Okay, so we know what we have to do. Let's just uh, not do it. Yeah. I really didn't like that distinction where it was like, oh, it has to be air. It has to be like certain kinds of spells. Like we would have never guessed that. <laughs> oh, the backpack, nice. There's oh, fuck. Fun, guy. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm going it. Uh, is there anything else up here? Or is it just like, yeah, it goes over here. That's fine. There's also this named axe in the woods, which is garbage, but. Named axe in the woods. Me just, yeah. It's axe in the woods. Yeah, well, fucking. Whatever. Maybe it'll evolve into a legendary weapon. I'm taking it. Fisherman's journal. It's been rough since I was laid off on the black pits. Uh, fishing's not easy. Okay. <laughs> Bottles of beer. Got a toad. No, I don't want to talk to that. How, how can you talk to a toad? It's, it's in the road, man. I'm scared. It's a rocky river toad. Okay. So rock, ro rocky. River frog. Guys, they'll shoot you through if you get too close. I'm gonna try and slip through the back way myself. I like a ch river challenge. Wow. So something's gonna shoot us if we go through here. Oh, you have to do. Oh, there's a fucking valuables here, though. Just right, Mike. Yeah. Take it. I know. I'm taking it. I'm leaving it for you. I, I, just, come on. Oh. Oh, unidentified shield. Wow, that's actually really good. Oh, what are these gloves? Well, I'll be the judge of that. Finesse, lucky charm, and bartering gloves for Seville. Lucky charm. Oh, gold for me. I need it. <laughs> Whoa, that shield is really good. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I- that's, dude, this is what I'm talking about. I think, like, we're just, like, we're under-geared. Because I'm still using, like, useless fucking shit. Uh, like, like, oh, look at my- look at my magic leather sacks. Fucking five magic armor, seven physical armor. Like, I just feel- we just feel under-equipped, so... At some point, yeah. Is this a fucking... what is this thing? Yeah, it's like a bridge. Alright. I'll step on it. I'm brave. I'm just looking around. We're probably not high enough for this area. There. What of it? I suspect these skulls were left here as a warning. You think? What's over here? A squirrel. And a level 15 mummy dearest. Mm, I don't know. What are you talking about? They're level 15 here? I can see if, like, see the woman in there? Mummy dearest? Yeah. <sighs> oh, there. Yeah. I mean, it's yellow, so maybe it won't be mad at us. No, I, I think it's not worth. Well, let's just let's just not tempt fate, you know. Yeah. Man, I want to go grab that tree trunk because I'm a fucking idiot, but let's get out of here. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to the other side of this place. Actually, I'm gonna go head this way. Ah, oh, dude, I made the right call. There's some wood in there. So I, I think we keep finding the wrong way of going. <laughs> I feel like you've not been going the right way since like five episodes ago. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, squirrel. Nice to have some squeaking elves around here again. They always put on such a show at those big old. Alright, it's it's time to play the game of which way is the right way, because holy shit. Well, I know there's, we're a, going there's another the way. There's another Hala's buried valuables. I would like to go there. 
Show us keep getting the loot. This is what we need right now. Yeah, I think that's. I honestly think that's what I do. What we need. Yeah. Alright, there's some fucking elves here. Maybe, maybe we should have, uh. Well, I'll have Sabiel talk to them. Or wait. Go no farther. You are warned. Go no farther. Go no further. We are at ritual. Do not disturb us. Uh. Finesse elf, tell, tell the elf to relax. You're kin after all, you mean no harm. The elf shakes his head slowly, his eyes fixed upon you with a stare of a hunter. This place is not for you. Leave. Okay, so probably I can convince him as Sabeel. Maybe, maybe no this further. guy will. We are at ritual. <laughs> Do not disturb us. <laughs> Tell the elder likes you're not human after all. <laughs> no, let's do. Mention you like to see the ritual. <laughs> no, Enter then. Keep respect. Alright, I'm a lot of. <laughs> Apparently, Prince is just better at everything. Let me see if I can get in. Elven warriors make ritual over the body of a mm. fallen comrade. They're chanting okay. low and fierce. The pain of their loss is manifest in every word. Laser ray skill book. Spontaneous combustion. Fireball. Fossil strike. Wow, they have a lot of skills here. Artillery plant. All right. Blood to earth, to wood, to birth. The blood of Sarius to this earth. Offer prayer to Tyr Sidarius for the re repose of Sarius' soul. The fuck. The tallest, strongest elf, whom you take to be the leader, gives you a sidelong glance and then turns away. She places the tip of a long bladed spear on poor dead Sarius' chest bone. Blood to earth. Her companions reach out and grasp the spear, ready to plunge it into Sarius' heart. I guess I should do nothing, because I think, uh, I think they don't like me. Yeah, do nothing. The leader gives you a curious look, then turns away. Blood to earth! Together they plunge the blade deep into Sarius's heart, then twist three times in practiced motion. Blood flows freely to the ground, and Sarius's heart lies open to the world, neatly cut she in could... four. <laughs> she could trick that up. <laughs> Delicious. Blood to blood! Each warrior plucks a piece of heart and places it in their mouth. Chewing solemnly, their leader looks to you to see what you will do. With great respect, take a piece of heart, put it in your mouth, and chew. Delicious. Saria's memories flood you. A warrior proud and true, you fight the lone wolves at the sawmill for Sahela, your scion, and for the future of all the elves, or all that still remain. But the fight goes ill. You and Tova draw fire that your friends may flee. You die in Tova's arms. Uh... Give, give Tova a, a slow nod of respect, you share a memory now. With the barest blink, Tova accepts your good wishes, then turns back to the corpse. Sarius is a warrior, proud and true. Blood to blood, earth to earth, wood to wood, birth to birth. Sarius becomes his tree. May Sarius take root. The elves pick Sarius's bloody corpse from the ground. Tova looks to you, then shakes her head. You should not help. The elf sends Sarius to his final resting place. His corpse rolls to a stop at the bottom of the pit. The elven leader stands and stares at her fallen comrade. Then she wipes away a tear and turns away. Oh, healing. All right. The elves were not impressed, but it could have been worse. That's what it says. So I, I guess I was supposed to help with the, the ritual. Fuck? Yeah, I don't know what it wants. No, it's, it's ghost trees. With dry, oh, bloodshot yeah. eyes, her face betraying no emotion. She does not turn toward you. Ask what do she and her people are doing. She did turn towards me. <laughs> what are they doing here? That is our business. I thank you for honoring Sarius. But perhaps it is best if you move on. Tell her to wait. It seems like your people have suffered loss. We'd like to help. She nods and casts her gaze back into the pit where her comrade lies. We lose too much. We lose our homes. We lose our safety. We lose each other. She looks into your eyes, her face set in a fierce frown. It is enough. No more. Uh. That's a, uh. That is a time of great losses. No one escapes untouched. No. But our turn. My 
people's turn is over. You attempt to honor us during the ritual. You attempt to honor Sarius. You help remember him. But we need help still, or we perish here. Not only these people here, but all of us. I wonder if you honor us once more. Uh, <laughs> ask what she needs. It is something of great importance to me and to my people. Our home forests are gone. The great trees are cut to pieces. The memories inside them nearly lost. They become nothingness unless we find our scion. Uh, we've heard of the signs before. They're like seeds containing the el all elvish memories, a safeguard against the destruction of the ancestor trees. Yes. There is nothing more important than a scion. We lose our forests to poachers, to the fog, to the divine order. We lose each other to the wars. A scion is our only hope to survive, to build again. And this scion, she, she is... Her voice catches in her throat. She is my daughter. Her name is Sahela, and she is taken from us. That is why we come here. That is why we lose Sarius, to find her. If she is lost, if our scion is lost, all our people are lost. She is everything. Her eyes narrow, her fists clench, and her mouth tightens to a thin line. Do you know the lone wolves? <laughs> Do we know the lone wolves? <laughs> Say that you've heard of a group of savage mercenaries that go by that name. Yes, savage is just right. They care for gold, not life. Sahela is taken to Fort Joy, and the wolves steal her from there. But she is strong. She is calm. She sees so much. Too much for one so young. We come here to get her back. To bring her home. She is everything to me. She is everything to us. Sahela, we met her daughter while we were at Fort Joy. You do? You speak to her? Then you understand. You see what a gentle soul she is. You see how kind. She is not only a scion, but a precious child. She cannot be lost. Uh, we'll try and help find her. Uh, any information might help. You honor us. Yeah, boy. I fear it is impossible for one of my kind to enter their base. They know we are here. They expect us. She is taken by their leader. A savage man named Roost Anlon. I do not know why, but I know she must return to me. If I lose her, I cannot lose her. We plan another assault. We cannot give up. It is better for us all to die than for Sahela to be lost. I only hope perhaps you find her before then. Good luck. Okay, so I'm kind of curious. They don't like the lone wolves. You are a lone wolf. Go talk to her. <laughs> you saved, right? Oh, uh, yeah, I just didn't know. Oh, so you see these fucking trippy trees, dude? I can actually talk to them. Well, let's, let's get out of the way. Nah, nothing new. Oh. Uh, hey, what trade? Oh, hey. Yeah, she has shitty stuff. Alright, let me talk to the tree. The tree form spirit slowly, oh, so slowly, becomes aware of you. When he speaks, it's low and slow. He grumbles, as if in discomfort or in pain. I see you. Ask the Elven Spirit how he died. A lone wolf took my life as I tried to take hers. She fought the battle well, at least as well as I. The mill. Ran red with blood. Much of it was mine. Ah! Ask the spirit how he would learn from his mistakes. That time is past. That fight is done. You must fight your own fight. You must win your own war. With a last great creaking groan, he returns to the business of securing his roots and takes his leave of you. The tree form spirit slowly. Uh, I see. <laughs> you can consume his source. 
I will try it. The tree no, 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 I'm buying shit, dude. Egg was roar. roar of pain. Egg was roar. <laughs> you take my sauce. You kill the elves. Uh, do it or don't do it. <laughs> do it. The tree form spirit roars in anger, pain, and fear, as if for all the elves. Oh god. <laughs> oh, it's just gone. Alright, that may have been an asshole thing to do. Yeah, no, definitely. Alright, uh, I'll load it. I'll load it. Uh, uh, what? No, no, it's fine. buying shit. Uh, but she wasn't selling anything good. It was fucking garbage. She's selling knockdown arrows. I figured that's good. Oh, uh, okay. That's... Having an abundance of those would be like, yeah, and I could just use that whenever you need it. But I want to see. I want to see what happens if I ate the tree. <laughs> Turns Appar out you eat the tree. Apparently, you eat the tree. What about the bigger tree? Which bigger tree? Bigger tree, you say? I'm surprised you don't see it. Uh. I mean, I'll point it out to you when we load in. Okay, there's a bigger tree, huh? I mean, maybe I didn't move my camera there? I don't know. Like, why are you surprised at anything? Also, I'm very unperceptive, you know this. I know, I know, but it's, I figured of all things. I mean, that, oh, that one there. I mean, I just yeah, didn't, oh, ha I, I, I didn't have the big. camera there. Like, I was, it was like a fucking, like, tiny here. Sure, buddy. All right, we're going. I see you. Okay, well, it sees me. <laughs> the mother is dying. The elves are dying. Help us, Sabil. Help the mother. Find her. Find our mother. Heal her. Heal the elves. All right. So we have. Um... We need you standing. Healed or not, I fight. We have a lot of... Uh, so I have, a, I have another passive point to put in. Parry master. No. Morning person. No. No, not that. Elemental affinity. No. Comeback kid. Maybe. Bigger and better. Attribute points to spend. That doesn't sound that good. Uh... I'm thinking of doing comeback kid, but I'm not wounds. sure. We need you standing. Healed or not, I fight. Well, what do you think we should do for? For who? Sorry, oh, for you. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Hmm. To get as a fucking passive point. I, I'm thinking just comeback kid. There's nothing better. Either that or get attribute attribute points or something. That's not that useful for me. I mean, it it, it at that point there's gonna be nothing else. And then sure. Not let your wounds fester. I'm surprised we don't get any more uh, talents as we level. Like it's really trying to do whatever. Yeah. Although living armor is pretty good. 35% uh, of all healing you receive is it goes towards your magical armor as well. Might be worthwhile because we do. Like, it's like, what else will we take at this point, right? I mean, do that or come back, kid, so... I'll, I'll take that one, that's fine. Alright, and let's do... A point in Warfare, I, I guess. Oh, no, 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 I want to do a point in Polymorph. There we go. And I guess now I just do... Constitution Strength. Wait, I have like... Th I have like a bunch... I have like three points. What the fuck? Maybe I had three points this whole time. Alright. So Beale hasn't leveled up yet, though. I never okay, will. Yeah, some arrows. All right, I have skin. Well, I have skin graft now, but that requires. And kill the lone wolves all. Oh, I still have bloodsucker. Huh. Thick of the fight. Living on the edge, rain blood. Just trying to be what to remove here. I mean, all of it's pretty good. Resets all cooldowns. Yeah. I don't really have any big cooldown abilities. Some of them are like five turns, but yeah. Alright, let's go. It's uh, interesting. How's Sabeel not leveled up? She's very close, though. So after we hit level 13... 
So is, is there anything good in that or no? Would you say? Anything good on what, sir? Uh, on the people that we were talking to before. On oh, just the arrows, which I've already okay. given. Like, just realizing that, seven more knockdown arrows. All right. It's like, you have no reason to not use them when you need to use them. Okay, we can go to the we can go to the sawmill, I guess. Someone's gonna fuck us up, probably. I mean, maybe, because these guys are level fifteen. Uh, I guess we'll go over here first. Yeah, let's yeah, let's go there. I mean, we're, I'm so close to level, so we could like finish black bets or something, but I don't know. Bench, uh, that's that's it. All roads, all right, right. All, all roads lead to impossible content that we shouldn't be doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Actually, there's a bridge right here. We can actually cross that, I'm sure. Maybe. Where the fuck does this lead? Oh, just up there. Uh, it's oh, to another sp spooky tree. Okay. I mean, we're, this is Paradise Sounds. We were here before, but we didn't continue. I don't remember why. Everything is very dark all of a sudden. All right. All right. All right. The death walk down there. That's spooky, actually. <laughs> the hall of death. Uh, dude, we have decaying on us. You have decaying on you. Well, permanent decaying in this area. Neat. All right. I'll. I will explore here anyways, though. Oh. The ground's trembling almost as bad as the Lady Vengeance on rough seas. Shocked cow. You know, I never did realize what to do with that fucking potion. Ow. Oh, quick, heal yourself. <laughs> Quickly. Man, apparently this place sucks. Oh, dude. I kept Cradlin's book of silly pranks. What the fuck? Oh, dude. Elven tribal customs. That discourse. Yeah. Obviously, we want to read that. A volume about elven society and customs speaks of an ancient ritual not seen before the Great War. Accounts detail how fire and stormy clouds were often seen above the ritual site, and afterwards the ground was sodden with blood and frozen in places, despite the warmth of summer. Okay, that's what we just did. Though. Uh, okay, there's a chest there, and I must have it. I do the bathtub down here. I must sit in it. Oh yeah, there is a chest there. So, like, we can teleport across from here, but what's the point? There, there is a ladder. You're in front of a ladder. Yeah, but there's a shit down there. What kind of shit? I mean, why go down there and risk dying when I can just be a piece of shit? <laughs> risk dying. Alright. I'm gonna go talk to the cow. Hey, a dominate mind skill book. I guess I'll learn it. be a grim harvest here this year. What's wrong with the cow? Look at the cow in Askins. Is he enjoying, uh, enjoying the destruction here? Or we can collect some milk? I don't think I want his milk. Alright, let's ask him if he's his? enjoying the destruction. Your kind has been dismembering and burning mine since time immemorial. I must admit, the smell of charred human flesh is so very enticing. Wow, and now I want to turn this thing into a steak. But no, it's not, it doesn't say his, it's just collect some milk. If you can find a bucket, sure. Consider it my last offering to a dying race. What a fucking piece of shit. Alright, so do you have a bucket? Uh, do I? Yeah, give you a bucket. Uh, I should have a bucket somewhere if I don't have one. Beast has it. Yeah, I have a bucket. Uh, it's, uh. There you go. We have a bucket now. Okay. Scissors, scissors. Collect some milk. If you can find a bucket, sure. Your kind is it's not letting me do it. Yeah, I guess not. I guess you're not supposed to collect milk from it. Right. It's racist. Well, let's go. Did we get the waypoint here? I assume we did, but maybe we didn't. Because I don't recall entering an area where everything started decaying. It sucks the to live here, man. Is almost to hide. The wind rises. Okay, so we got Paradise Downs. Alright, where else do we go? Oh wait, I think we, I think we did see this area. We looked different from afar. I was like, yeah, fuck that. 
<laughs> Concussed, yeah, fuck this area. Uh, alright. Where do we want to go then? I guess down towards uh, here or something? Further down, I guess, yeah. How do we make it down there? Praying? I mean, we could also there. go over here as a chest, though. Let's see what, let's yeah, see well, I'm that. up for that. Let's go there. A pitchfork. Get your pitchforks out, guys. Dude, where does this area even go? Corpse. I, I don't know how much further I want to go up here, that's the thing. Alright, well. Money. Get Sabeel over there. How's it going? We're still decaying. Yeah, there's a chest over there. I'll go get the chest. It's my lot in life. Everything is decaying. Where is he going to jump to anywhere else from the. Right. Maybe down into the fuck down there, the fucking death fog. There's a dead magister sword. There's some dead. Oh, there's some inquisitor. What the fuck is going on here? Just cold. Ah. All right. So there's the harbinger of doom, level fifteen. So we have once again wandered into a <laughs> no to come here anymore. <laughs> yeah, it's Wavenhall. They're dead magister knights and stuff. Yeah, well, we're not even gonna fucking bother with that. Fuck that noise. Plus with a Kang too? Jesus. Yeah. Hey, you know what we could maybe do? Stop what? though. What? That arena fight we didn't do? I mean, yeah, we're kind of getting to that point where we could actually benefit from that. Alright, there's some, uh... Almira. Let's go talk to her. Oh, Magister's Two-Hander. I'll just give that to you. Actually, it's really not that bad, but not as good as what I have. Very close, though. Alright, where's, uh, where's Sabeel? Actually, can't I just, like, teleport a permit to you? And both of us come here? Yeah, if you linked, you should. Yep. Magister Inquisitor. Alright, I'm gonna go talk to the Inquisitors in here. What the fuck happened here? You sense a blur of movement to your side. Before you can react, there's a blade under your chin and a slim, pale hand upon your weapon. A voice whispers in your ear with a breathy purr. I mean, I, I kind of saw them, but whatever. A guest. How brazen of you to enter without knocking. There is a lot of uh, spells there. The press of the, the blade cells. encourages you further into the room, then retreats. You turn to face a woman in black ring robes. She's pale and vividly beautiful, wearing a smile that's somewhere between impish and cruel. Perhaps I'll give you a chance to explain yourself. Uh... Uh, remark that there, she, she's clearly no farmer. She must be trespassing too. She lowers her weapon and gives you a curious look. Not because of your response, though. She's noticed something. You're no ordinary traveler, are you? You positively reek of source. Are you the one responsible for this mayhem surrounding us? <laughs> uh, <laughs> But her nerves to the test is clear that yes, the carnage on all areas is all your handiwork now. We deny any responsibility. And and add that you're further seeking you're you're seeking to further your knowledge of source. And whoever turned this stretch of cow country into a death filled valley is likely to be powerful enough to help you. Is that what you thought? You look like someone who wouldn't turn down a good thing when it comes to them. How about a little deal? You help us, and I'll show you how to make true use of source. She gestures to where a young magister is propped up on a cot in the corner. He's ashen and dazed, his shoulder bound in layers of crimson-soaked wound dressings. This is Mahali. We absconded together. I from the Black Ring and he from the Magisters. We fell for each other while I was his prisoner. Love will set you free. Mahali put himself at great risk to free me from magister captivity. We made it clear, but he picked up quite a nasty wound. We found refuge in this charming hamlet. But then, well, I'm sure you saw for yourself. 
The landscape tore itself open, void woken appeared, and a shroud of decay fell over us. It's preventing Mahali's wounds from healing. So, now we must escape this place, or else remove the decaying shroud so Mahali can heal. Help us, and I'll help you. Mm. <laughs> You're trying to remove the decaying. Do you, you manage that? I don't think it went off because you saved at the right time. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> at the right time. I mean, like, you saved at the exact same time and, like, ate the frame or something. It just didn't cast. <laughs> like, it took the cooldown. It just didn't cast it. It's weird. Okay. I'll try it again, then. That's just, uh, just waiting. I mentioned Driftwood isn't far. You mentioned Journeyers, so... Nah, we can agree to help if... You, uh, let's see. Hey, heal him? What? I'm listening. Oh. No, it went away again. No, 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 don't do it now. Don't do it now. <laughs> Alright, we can clear Thank a path. You. Please, clear the way so that we can head south in the direction of the coast. The north is too dangerous. It crawls with Voidwoken. Once you've helped Mahali and I pass freely, once we're truly clear, I'll give you what you want. Her eyes speak volumes. All that you want. So you're going to investigate the strange yeah. decaying first. Uh, okay, we'll agree Good. to do. Now listen closely. Clear anything that will impede Mahali. Flames. Those accursed fumes. Anything. Come back here when there's a safe route. And we will follow you. Alright, so she wants a clear route. Oh my lord. Okay. I mean, we can do this, I think. I mean, we can also try healing. I mean, you can try that too. Where'd you go? Oh, you're at that. Oh, you want, you want me to do a healing as well? Because I, I can't I can't click it as fast. Just okay. don't do the regen, because it will kill him. Yeah, I'll, first, I'll, aid. first aid, first aid. Okay, just give me a sec. The pain's getting worse. Hey, we healed him. We'll find a way out of this. Alright. I mean, it's gonna take a couple times, but, I mean, guess <laughs> who? <laughs> Do you think it'll work? <laughs> Let's try one more time. Alright. I, I think I can fast on the draw, I can heal him with a healing ritual. Okay. <laughs> He's almost healed. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, one more time, and then we got it. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna suck his source away. <laughs> this, this isn't gonna work. <laughs> you know I, 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 I know, I know. Dude, I, I like, I like finding a way Don't around. Don't worry, this. I'll keep watch. I will. Yeah, you'll keep watch. <sighs> all right, all right, lady, he's fully healed. <laughs> Don't worry. I'll go, <laughs> I'll go talk to her about The Halley is fading. The Halley is fading. Can we escape? <laughs> he's fading. fading away like he's barely holding on. Uh, we haven't cleared a path yet. She slinks over and cups your chin in her hand, not entirely gently. Time is an asset, dear. A dwindling one. Now please, hurry along and do as you promised. Oh, man. That's how do we clear a path? What is the uh, deal? Okay, Leo? basically what she said was like clear like any kind of surfaces that are like bad um, that he can walk into that are dangerous and we gotta we gotta get it, make a path from outside of this place. Somehow. I actually don't know how we're supposed I don't know how he's supposed to leave, to be perfectly frank. Maybe to the Wait, no, how do we get to the waypoint shrine from here? He was not possible. Shocked sheep. Ah, this is madness. I'm, I'm having flashbacks from the Great War. Uh, uh, ask him minds of giving up a bit of wool. Oh, but you better grab a pair of shears. I'm not about to let you just rip it out of I guess. Silly. Uh, the Great War, ask the sheep whose side it was on. The Black Ring, of course. At least they're honest about how wicked they are. Ask the sheep what's happening here. The gangle legs have gone nuts for good this time. They're destroying the place for reasons too stupid to know. I mean, it just says I can't reach anywhere. 
So how is he supposed to leave? I mean, maybe I'll maybe I'll save it and I'll I'll like. What the fuck are you doing? Oh, you're just removing. You can clear. I'm just doing you know, clean up duty. I'm playing Visser clean up detail. <laughs> we'll find a way out of this. Uh, I'll, uh, uh, well, I, I think we should clear the, the uh, sorry, uh, Can we clear. Uh, probably end the episode now. So I think we'll end the episode here, guys. So thanks a lot for watching, guys, and take care. And we'll we'll try this out. Bye. Right, bye. Bye.